I'm Paul McKinley. I'm running for the 2nd Congressional District, and I'm showing this video so that the people in Pembroke, Hobson Park, who they are duping down there, talking about it's going to be an airport down there. The airport is going to be right around here because this is going to be the lifestyle of the rich and infamous. The Lakeside Development is a 600-acre master plan that you're not involved in. It's on from 79th to 90, 91st and 92nd. It consists of 15,000 residential units, 17 million square feet of rental, restaurants, commercial, institutional, and research factories. Also, it is alleged that they will build Barack Obama's library right here, right over there. 97,000 construction jobs and related jobs. They will have 27,000 commercial office ins institutional job create will be created. It would also have 13,000 retail jobs will be created. Just this, this improvement that you see right here. This is called, this is Route 41. For this improvement, the, the, the uh, digging up the ground, the excavation, will be $65 million just for this improvement. We ain't even talked, they ain't built a house yet. It's, it's 10 miles from downtown Chicago, and it's two times larger than the loop. And it's a rock away from the Gary Chicago Airport. They're telling you that they're gonna build an airport down there. It's a smoke screen, it's a sly hands. All it was was to keep electing of elected officials. This is this airport is less than six miles away from lakeside development. So this airport is gonna be the third airport, and not only is it gonna be the third airport, it's underutilized now. They only have one flight out of here now. So why would they build something down there and they can build it right here and they can drive to their house? They can catch the train to downtown from right here and get there in less than 15 minutes. So why would they move, uh, put an airport in Piatone? It was all a smoke screen to get elected over and over and over again. There is no jobs, there is this all phony. It, where the jobs at right here? Look at it. This is a real airport. Ladies and gentlemen, what you see here is the biggest development in North America. And if you elect the wrong person, they're going to hand all this over to the machine. The machine must own the second congressional district candidate because he must own this. We're talking about a 40-year plan that's billions and billions of dollars. And if you notice, not one other candidate other than me is saying anything about this. And the reason why that other candidate is not saying this, because this is a blackout. They're making this a blackout. Just look at it. Look how big this is. Look how huge this is. How is it that this is not on the news? How is it that this is not in any debates? How is it that this is not being brought about on by any other person? If you want to benefit from this, you're going to need somebody that's going to go against the machine. If you want to know about this, you need to know, talk to people that's not a part of the machine. The machine has silenced every candidate that's running for office, and none of them won't say nothing about this. And you did not know nothing about this because they're going to give all the jobs to the unions. They're going to, they're going to bring people from other states to do the work. This gives you a chance to vote the right person in.